Okay, so we're here and let's talk about Luther. Okay, once again, I'm Jazz, aka NY. And I'm Britt, aka BX. All right, and our channel, NYCWAO, please subscribe. But anywho, once again, we're talking about Luther. Let's talk about Luther. Season three just ended in September. Um, it was about four episodes. Four episodes, yeah. And we haven't done reviews on Luther, so we're going to start doing reviews. And we're starting from the beginning. I just got on to Luther. Britt had to put me on. Uh, again, uh, just like Scandal. But I enjoyed Luther. Loved it from the first episode that Luther's I saw. Crazy. And I actually, the first episode I saw was the season two episode. But what we're going to do a report on today about is episode one, season, season one. one. The introduction of Luther. The introduction of my man. <laughs> my big, strong, <laughs> black, Swiss, Swiss man. Mm. Okay? Idris. 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 Elba. Yes, however you pronounce it. But on Luther, he is John Luther. John. Um, and he's a, a chief detect, chief inspector. DCI. What is that? Detective Chief Inspector. I know yes, everything about Lu my man. Luther. <laughs> <laughs> but the first episode introduces John Luther. It introduces his wife, Zoe. Zoe. It introduces Ripley, who, who becomes his partner. Mm -hmm. It introduces my fave, Alice Morgan. Alice. It was Morgan, right? Alice yeah, Morgan. Alice Morgan. Yes. And I mean, it introduces his friend at Ian. It's like yeah, Ian. the first. What I like about the Luther um, episodes is that so much happens. Mm -hmm. Everything is so much jam packed into one. And episode. it's not too much, but, but it, yeah, it's, it's not like sloppy. you're watching a movie. It's like you're watching a movie. But um, so first episode starts off with Luther. He catches this guy who's been kidnapping girls. Girls, yeah, he was a. a rapist and murderer he was murdering young girls and stuff and he had homie hanging from some ledge in some and industrial type factory thing. building that you don't want to be in bottom line yeah, and he and stood I there watching homie hold on until he gave him the answer to where the young lady was um hidden and the thing is so it, so that's how the episode opens luther gets in trouble because homie falls because luther, luther didn't pick him up yeah. and um so then he's going back to work finally yeah, yeah, because yeah. Homie's in a coma. Yeah, he, he he's in a coma. Yeah, and, and Luther, I guess they don't say it. We don't see it, but I guess he had like he was he was going through. He he went crazy for a second, I guess. So he took some time off. And like the first episode after, you know, like we're seeing him going back to work. Uh, so he's going back to work, and he calls Zoe. Zoe, his wife, and this is, and the crazy thing is, this is how that was introduced, and this is it, it's very different because usually in a show. It'll start out where they're doing great. The wife and husband are still yeah, together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They with the, This show started out where the wife and husband, John Luther, who Idris Elba's character, and his wife, Zoe, Zoe, Zoe I, excuse me, Zoe, <laughs> were having problems. Yeah. And she basically told him, rap, I don't want to mm -hmm. be with you anymore. He had, so he called her and he was like, Zoe. And he's like, he, he's like, Zoe. And she was like, uh, John, is that you? And he was like, yeah, you know, I'm doing good and everything. Yeah. We should get back to, you know, we should hook up. And, and it was, it was cute because he was like, I'm doing better. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm doing, I'm you know. I really am. He, he really was and like. she was like that. And he was like, I'm going back to work. And she was like, that's great, John. I knew, you know, I knew they weren't going to, yeah, I know, I knew he was going to go back to work and be fine or whatever. And he's like, can I see you? And she was like, um, I gotta go. Yeah, she played him. And then, you know, she basically was kissing on the next nigga. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess I shouldn't have said nigga. But, yeah. Uh, she was the kissing on the me. next. <laughs> yeah, I mean. <laughs> well, so, uh, yeah, yeah. So, um, does it, he, he, when he does see her, um, he goes to the house. First of all, this is his house where he used to live. But he goes to the house or whatever, and she was like, you know, I told you I had a dinner um, date. You know, whatever. And he's like, whatever. I don't care. I'm just going to come see you. I'm going to talk to you. Mm -hmm. So, you know, he's telling her of all, you know, professing his love to her and everything. And she was like, John, there's someone else. Yeah. And he said, what is it now? And, yeah. <laughs> she, and she was like, you know, I, I'm with someone else. And he was like, do you love him? And she was like, and he was like, why? No, 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 Zoe, why? And then he commenced to break down the door. He broke and down the door of the house. 
I mean, it was like an ape just came in the building. He just started banging on the door. The door shattered. But it was quite sexy, if you ask me. But um, she was afraid, like some crazy lady. I, well, she wasn't like, <gasps> she was just like, I think she felt like more ashamed than sad more than anything. Because it's like, yeah, you're ruining this man's life. Broke that man's heart. I mean, and it's crazy, though, because it's like, that's, it was just crazy. And, and she was like, you know, you need to go. And he was like. You yeah, know, she said, what? And he was like, he said, this is my house. Said, and, she my said, house. and she said, no, leave. John. No, leave. And he left. But this is where it got, I mean, that that was very entertaining. But where it got, <laughs> <laughs> where it got like real serious was Alice Morgan mm -hmm. coming into the picture. Alice Morgan, off Alice. her parents. I mean, off to parents and then stuck the gun in the dog. Yes. So, yeah, when, when he gets to the house, um, um, I, well, John, he gets to the house with Ripley or whatever. You see how you keep, she keep getting ready to call him Idris. Yeah. <laughs> but um, he gets to the house with um, Ripley or whatever, and the father is at the desk, the computer, gunshot to the head. Uh, the mother's in the bed, gunshot to the head. The dog is on the floor, his whole face is gone. Like, Word. face off. Face off. Like, the whole, <laughs> he, she shot up the whole face. And she called, she made 911, sorry, 999 call. Yeah, because they don't call 911. They call 999. Yeah. So she See, made, I'm not calling that number because upside down, that's 666. So I'm just going to have to stay strapped up shorty if I get out of face. <laughs> <laughs> but, um... So, yeah, so, um, he's, um, uh, you know, interviewing her or whatever, and he's like, you know, I'm sorry about everything, blah, 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 and she's pulling the whole, <gasps> we think it, today. We thinking somebody came in there exactly, off Alice's like parents. Exactly, like it's a home invasion, and, um, so it gets serious when he's talking to her and everything, and I guess he already felt like she wasn't answering the questions but No, right. because remember, when he was, um, um, going through the scene with Ripley, yeah, he said, it's he not said, right. this is not right. Because there was no evidence, And that's nothing. what, John says that whenever... It's not right. And he goes. He says. He squints this is his, not his right. eyes and go. With his hands in his pocket and goes. Wait, how does he say he squints his he eyes? He'd be like, "It's not right." I just Elba squints his right. eyes a lot. Yeah, he does. <laughs> but um, it's cute. But uh, <laughs> um, yeah. So Alice Morgan. In Alice the Morgan. Yeah, mm -hmm. in the um investigation. What's it called? Not investigation, interrogation. Um. Anyway, she he he gets up, he goes and gets her some tea or whatever, and then he comes back and he's like he's putting on. He's like, oh, I'm sorry, you know, I had a long oh, yeah, day. Yeah, yeah. And she was like, yeah, it's been a long day for everybody, like something crazy like that. And then he was like, oh, excuse me for a minute, and he leaves, and he was like, it was her, she did it. And he was like, Alice Morgan is a malignant narcissist. Yeah, and I'm gonna be honest with you, I was like, and how did he get this? And see, but here it is. He was like, I yarned and she didn't yarn. It's because it was only them two in the room. So, you know, when there's only two people in the room and you yarn, one of them yarn, the other one is going to yarn. Yarning is contain contagious. And she didn't. And he was like, because um, that's the part of your brain that um, that uh, is it shows empathy or whatever. And because she didn't yarn, that shows that she has no empathy. Meaning that she didn't care about killing her parents. So she did it. That's crazy, though, because I don't yarn when other people yarn. And I empathize with people. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Alice Morgan. Oh, I love man. Alice Morgan. Why? Now, and let me tell you what made me love Alice Morgan. I was like, I started to like her throughout that first episode. Now, when she stuck that needle in Zoe's ear, that was crazy. It was no, it was a bit, no, not even that she did that, but she was lying on John, making him some sound like some horrible man. So my, he but the, but, did that but what it is is that Alice liked John. She liked John during From that the, interrogation. Yes, yeah, she did. If you pay attention to her eyes and how her lips slightly parted when yeah, he was squinting like, his and eyes, she, got out, the little, like, she was like. Like, she liked John. But when he was about to throw her over that bridge because she stuck that needle in Zoe's ear. Yeah, but let's, let's, yeah, go, let's back. go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. She paid Miss Zoe a visit. Yeah. Okay? But the reason why she paid Zoe a visit is because... because John went and he, he realized that he, there was no evidence. So he was like, the gun has to be somewhere. He realized, like, why did she shoot the dog's face off? So he was like, she must have put the gun in the dog. No, but John and Alice had started to become, in a weird way, friends. friends? 
kind of. Because he she was, kept calling him. She kept calling him, and he kept picking up the phone. Mm -hmm. And you know that that don't make no sense. It doesn't. That don't make no type of sense. It doesn't. What are you talking to Alice on the phone for, John? But she knew that there was a connection. The funny part is... There was a connection. John had to know there was a connection because why would he still be talking on the phone with her? But he didn't want to know that there was a connection. Yeah, because that's just crazy. It is crazy. But so anyway, he realized that she put the gun in the in um the dog. So he goes to her. He's he breaks into her house and finds the urn because they cremate everyone. You know every every person no, but that that's died. That's not why she um hit up Zoe though. She hit up Zoe before that. He hit up that. Oh, yeah, yes. he did that after she did that to Zoe. So yes, why did she go Because she crazy. Just what because, you talking about? Yeah, yeah. Cause because she knew about his wife. She was doing research yeah, on she him. Started researching she him. did research on him. And then she um hit up his wife. And she also wanted to know about, uh what's his name? Uh, Henry, Henry Madsen, yeah, the, why, the killer that why he, that fall. Yeah, the guy who fell. But the thing is, what I thought was outstanding about Zo um Alice, when I really fell in love with Alice, that character was after John stole the urn and all of that stuff, and he was about to throw her over that bridge and told her. Well, he wasn't really stay. about to throw her over the bridge. He just he was choking her out, leaning her over the bridge. He wasn't really gonna throw her. Like that's, hmm. that's yeah. He was gonna throw her over that bridge. Okay, so. black bottom line. He wasn't because he was when he said, "You stay away from Zoe," you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, he was gonna throw her over. Yeah, well, when she said, when he had her hanging over that bridge. And she was looking at him, breathing heavy. And what did she say? She said, "Do something." She said, no, she, said "She said, kiss." Go ahead. She said, "Go ahead, come on, <laughs> kiss me, kill me, do something." And then she went, "Loved it." I said, when she said that, that's what I said. I like her because she felt it. She was like, "This is this is serious." It was passion. They're crazy. She's crazy. He's a little crazy, but it works. I was like, I like this. And that's when, that was my favorite scene of the whole whole show, that episode. My other favorite scene was when he broke down that door, because that was just... Mm. That was crazy. Yeah, <laughs> but so, yeah, after she, um... After she said that, whatever, he, he, you know, he walks away from her. And he was just like, yo, stay away from Zoe. And then he was like, ah, because she thought that she threw, because he threw the urn in the, in, the, in the river. And she thought that the gun part was still in the urn, but he took it out. And she was like, uh, like this dude. But then he threw it on the floor. Like, and, but mind I ain't you, worry about I, nothing. The I don't... urn is the dog. Yeah, the, the, dog the dog who dog. she stuffed the gun <laughs> in his belly, which was very smart because she knew they would cremate the dog. Mm -hmm. They would not check the dog's remains. So therefore, she hid. The evidence, mm -hmm. which is crazy. Yep. But he knew that she wanted to keep that evidence as proof. Like, yeah, this is what like, I'm capable yeah. of. This is what I'm about. Because she's a narcissist. She's crazy. Um, But when he threw the pieces of the gun on the floor, that told her, like, I'm not doing this with you. I don't have time with you for you. I don't want to play this game with you. I'm done. Just stay away from my wife. And she was like, you know, like, oh, there's no such thing as love, whatever, whatever. How could it be love if... She said, all it's going to do is making you corrupt and lonely and you're doing this for some chick that don't even want you and was like, peace out. And he was like, put his ring on was like, in a second, I would. And but see, my thing is, see, I got from that, I personally felt that Alice, because I am Alice Morgan, I felt <laughs> that Alice did not get from that, oh, you're done with me. I think what Alice read into that is you care because why did he keep it? For her and why did he give it back to her? Because he knew that it was important to her. He knew it meant something to her to mm -hmm. have that, which showed from that episode that he was feeling something for her. Mm. 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 Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Cause why would he give it back to her? Be be I don't, I, I, see, I guess I'm thinking about him. He threw it on the floor. It's not yeah, really that's like he's what giving he, it back to her. He did give it back to her. He gave her back the pieces of the gun, which she needed to Because at first when validated. he took it out, it looked like, oh, like, I have this evidence. You're going to go to jail. And then he threw it on the floor because he's, it's a cat and mouse thing that she was doing. She was like, you're investigating me and I'm investigating you. Yeah, his whole <laughs> thing was, he's giving it back and this, I'm giving this back to you. So, and you better leave my, um. Wife alone. wife alone. But he also threatened her with uh, her, her no longer being an enig enigma. Mm -hmm. That he's going to pin it on somebody else. But what you don't understand is Alice Morgan did not see it as that. She saw it as you care. Okay. That's why you gave me back what I wanted. Why I kept this urn in the first place. Mm -hmm. She didn't keep the urn for the dog. 
Yeah, and she didn't. She also didn't keep the earring of her parents. There was no. Bow. Maybe it was, was buried. Only... Who knows? They didn't That's get into that. Because why would they just bury the doll too? No, why would that, she? No, why would she put the dog on her mantelpiece and not her parents? <laughs> That's true, but no, you forgot. Their protocol was to cremate the dog. The police department, the department. Mm -hmm. remember? Yeah, that's what he said, and he and that's what he was like. She had to know that. That's why. Yeah, yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. See, she loved her some Idris Elba, but she on. This but they don't thing. cremate everybody. I thought that they cremated all of them. No. 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 Mm, we gonna have to look back at that so Listen. <laughs> all I care about. All I know is that Alice Morgan. No, Alice is Alice is the truth. But in, in okay, even in this first episode, Alice went to the hospital where Henry Madison was in a coma because she was trying to. She was just trying to. She was just messing with John. She, she was trying to mess with him. But it's because she liked him. She was like a little girl in school. You know, you like a little boy or whatever. A little boy when they like someone and they start pulling Probably on your yeah, hair yeah. and doing all that stupid crap. That's what she was doing. She was pulling John's hair. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But, um, uh, let's but, talk, first of all, speaking of hair, let's talk about the fact that I just always said it was not always done in this Yeah, show. he was looking like, a hot mess. He was looking a little scruffy. Like, he got, he got, he's not, he's not, he doesn't have, like, the nappy dugout, but it was just, like, sometimes it was, like... Yeah, I, I bet the, but it that... It looked like he came on set, threw blood on his hair. But that was, was like, what was actually, good about the show. Like, he wasn't, you know, all swathed up, you know, and you still, you, you, you liked him. He's, he's likable. Yeah. You know, even though he's a little bit corrupt, just a little bit. Just a little bit. But I thought that the first episode was great. For well, first episode for... Uh, well, the first episode, it was crazy. Yeah, it was really good. And there was a lot of stuff going on. It was. Um, uh, also, the dude that Zoe is Zoe's with now, and he lives in the house with her now. Um, Mark. Yeah, Mark. He came into the picture. Uh, Luther, after he spoke to um, Alice... Uh, you know, it's after he, he took the urn from Alice, Alice shoved the thing in, the little needle in Zoe's ear and was like, oh, your husband is crazy, blah, 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 whatever. Um, he went to Zoe again, because he wanted to talk to her. Now, Zoe, but mind you, Zoe <laughs> called Luther when Alice came and attacked her. Yeah, exactly. You call him for help, right? So then he comes to the house with her. He's knocking on the door. She's not answering. And he's like, Zoe, Zoe, I just went and talked to you. And, uh, <laughs> and she calls the police. And she was like, oh, I feel I really don't want to do like, this. She's like, I don't want to do this, but I'm my so ex-husband. I don't know what he's doing. So Mark comes out, and he's like, listen, John, just go home. And John was like, uh, uh no, you're Mark, right? Yeah, I, I, I just want to talk to my wife. I just, no, he didn't even say that. He said, I just want to talk to Zoe. I need to talk to her. And he was like, you, she just needs some time. And he was like, dude, I just need five minutes. I just want to talk to her. Mm -hmm. And then Mark punches him in the Sucker face. Sucker punches him. Yeah. So he, you know, he gets him in the... Uh, of course, uh, you know, uh, uh, Luther, uh, throws him on the car. And, and of course, that, the cops come and show moment. up while the black man is beating on this white man. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> but, um, so, you know, then he was like, listen, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, a cop and... Yeah, they back off. Rank is above but then, me. then Zoe comes out talking about wait, wait. She didn't have to do that. Period. All yeah. she had to do was come to the door. Head. Zoe's a bird, a mess, straight like that. Okay. So she she came out. And she was like, no, oh well, you know, stop, please stop, please stop, because it was a bunch of cops ganging up on John. And he was like, you know, I know you gotta, you want to be where you need to be. You need your space, whatever. I respect it, but I still love you. And she was like, and he was like, I'm sorry. She was like, don't say sorry. And they hugging and whatever. And Mark is sitting there like. And all Luther basically was doing was letting her go. Mm -hmm. Like saying, all right, this is, what you, this is what you chose. You know, I'm letting you go. It was, it was emotional. It was but emotional. Mark still is whack for standing there. And, and watching her, his, his, well, his girlfriend crying over the, the last dude all hugged up with him and stuff. But oh, technically, he wasn't the last dude. That's technically, still his husband. That's, her, that's his wife. So mm -hmm. he's still that dude. That's true. She's the trifling one. Already got a new man. Yeah, they didn't tell us how much space, with how much time lasts between. It don't even separation matter. Or whatever, it but... don't even matter. She's yeah. still married to Luther, John, John Luther. John. Okay, I don't like Zoe. I I, I would have liked her if she didn't pull that move. But when she pulled that move, I was yeah, like, it was, kinda, done. it was it was like you called the cops on this man. How you gonna like... call the cops on him? Like get out of here with that. So anywho, that's our uh, review. Of Luther episode one mm -hmm. season one mm -hmm. and episode one gets a status report of turn up all the way it gets a status report and I think the, and the main reason why it gets a status report of turn up 
simply because Idris Elba is in it. Yes. And Alice Morgan. Alice Morgan was the star of that episode. And it made me like, yes, this is, this is, she outshined I just yeah, know, it, in my it, It's like, I mean, and the episode was like almost an hour long, but I was just like, listen, we, just, I need the next one right now, immediately. Yeah. Luca. It was, it was pretty good. Yeah. So, subscribe, 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 and YCWAO stands for New York Chick with an Opinion. I'm Jazz, a.k.a. NY. And I'm Brittany, a.k.a. BX. And please check out our website, nycwao.com. Deuces.